got a great tag team action coming up with Tony Moose and Malta against Next Generation. Bet. All right? I'm in the mood for a good steak. A little Don Pepper to Newark. How about Sparks? Sparks. Peter well, Luger. Well, wait, let me go make sure to Johnny. All right, yeah. Oh, yeah, Sparks. Come on. What, what, what Moose and Moose are going to do This brutality at its best right here, right? Absolutely. Look at it. Put it up close line. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, and Tony the Moose is rocking and reeling. Moose is down. Next generation going after Tony the Moose. Oh. Take his legs out. Oh! Well, I tell you what, I hate to say it, but the next generation is actually outsmarting the Wops. Uh, you know what? That's not saying much. I mean, uh, no, that's not a smart move. No, he's not going to pick him up. You cannot slam the moose. If he dressed, he'd pick him up, he'd wake up and apologize. That is the Italian condominium. The Italian condominium only comes down when he wants it to go down on an opponent. You know, we're looking at this match showing, you know, in Edison on March 19th at the New Jersey Convention and Expo Center, these two teams will be part of a 14 4 way to determine the number one contender and, for the title. Who are the other two teams? The Zaccone brothers. Zaccones. And also the Japanese assassins. So, would you say that Johnny Diamond might have the odds in his favor? Well, he's got two of his teams in there. Okay. Now, what happens if these two teams uh, disagree on who should be number one? Well, I think Johnny Diamond will be able to control him. You think so? Oh, he always has. Well, right there is a big mistake. Why would you shoot him into the other party? Because they don't care. They don't care. Or they're that stupid. Well, no, they're that intimidating. Look, look at Malta just yelling over at Matt. Yo, Malta physically is a big man. Needs to put on a little more muscle, a little more size. And I think he needs a little, a little more of a brain transplant. You know, he's been listening to Johnny Diamond. He's been rotting his brain. They should take Luke Costello's brain and put it in his body. Or Bobo the Chimp's brain and put it in his body. Right now, he's brutally assaulting. And that's, that's, let's face it, these two are nothing more than the higher thugs. Well, you know, they, they again, here's a team that may deserve a shot at the tag team champion. Well, and we're going to see what happens. If they win that four-way elimination at, at the Spring Slam, they will be the number one contenders. Don't forget, Joey G, at that same show, big suplex there. Andrew Anderson defends the heavyweight title against the legend, Mr. USA, Tony Atlas. But then again, we don't know who if who they're going to be wrestling because the tag team championship is also on the line at for Christmas the Owens brothers with Kamala and the missing link. And they will be managed and led to the ring by Kimchi, none other than Howard Stern's Fred the Elephant Boy. Fred the Elephant Boy is going to be there. That's correct. It's unbelievable. Here comes Big Moose. And I hear, Gino, there's going to be lots of other surprises. Ladies match with Teresa Lopez against Lady Lee. The Latina sensation. I mean, Lady Lee is very upset that she hasn't gotten to play to Teresa Lopez. Well, yes, and I can't stand it. Look at here, Ms. Moose is just, just manhandling it. Oh, did you Don't see that? Don't forget we have the fabulous world, world famous midget wrestlers will be there. And special guest referee, Beetlejuice from the Howard Stern Show. Unbelievable, ladies and gentlemen. That's worth the price of admission in itself. And don't forget, special appearance by the extremist himself, the legendary hardcore Sabu. You don't see the midgets anywhere else, but when you see them in ECPW, the imitators will uh -oh. imitate them. Right now, oh, I don't think he got quite got all of that one. Joey G, the match is there. Unbelievable, Crazy Ivan will defend that TV title. And, and you know what, we're gonna see him later on tonight. You know, he had a big role, a major role, in uh, the absence of Jay Santana. Well, Jay Santana's been gone for almost two months. Due he to the injury of Crazy Ivan, he actually tore the quadricep of Jay Santana. Uh-oh, right there. Side slam by the big man. The quadricep or the quadricep? Quadricep, that's your leg muscle for you. Oh. Is it upper or lower? That's the upper leg. Oh, thank you. I we haven't seen him in some time, Joey. I failed geometry in uh, high school. Crazy Ivan says this, that Jay Santana doesn't have the guts or the intestinal fortitude to meet him face to face. I say Crazy Ivan is going to wake up soon and find that out is wrong. Well, you know, it, 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 the knock on Jay Santana has been that he's just not, oh! he's just not emotional enough. 
Well, I'll tell you what. He's not determined enough. I'll, I'll tell you what, the next time he gets to see Crazy Ivan, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of motion running through the body of Jay Santana. I know he's been in touch with and talking to the promoters. He wants a rematch. He says he's coming back. We got to wait and see him. We shall see. But meanwhile, we got the dunce cap going on Matt Mitchell's head. Well, you know what? I think the moose and I think, uh, you know, the big ball to here are taking these guys way too lightly. Well, they're having some fun with them, which I can understand. Because they're a fun tag team. Yeah, they look like a bunch of fun guys. Your buddies, right? Well, look at Johnny Diamond out there. Oh! Oh, he crashed. These two next generation got to really fire up. Oh, here it comes. Louis Zacone with a chair. What's he doing? He's going to crack Matt Mitchell over the head. Oh. Whoa, what a clothesline. He's got the chair. Well, I guess the wrestlers organized protection service are all on the same page right Johnny now. Johnny Diamond now uh, distract. Oh, he hit Moose. Oh. Was that by what? mistake? No, he looks upset. No! No! It can't be! Oh! Listen to these fans! Listen to these fans! They're going on him all! Oh my God, Joey G! I can't believe it! Blow it ahead! Give me a steak dinner! I, you kidding me?